Hey, this is a Heinz Ward, and I'm trying to become an Iron Man, and you're watching JR Sports Brief. So look, folks, it's JR. You're checking out the Sport Brief. You already know the deal. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and click that button right there. Yesterday, we spoke about James Harden and whether or not he was better than Dwayne Wade. I think Dwayne Wade has a little bit more to prove. But right now, we're going to preview the upcoming Dallas Mavericks season. I'm talking 2013 to 2014. And there's a good reason that I have this Caterpillar truck or whatever the hell you call it right behind me. And that's because the Dallas Mavericks, they have been under construction for the past two years, especially since they went ahead and they won that NBA championship. It doesn't seem like any free agents want to end up in Dallas. And Dirk Nowitzki, he's not getting any younger, but they have finally surrounded him with someone like Monte Ellis. You can probably expect Monte Ellis to get like 25 points a game, especially with Jose Calderon passing him the ball. Vince Carter is back to come off the bench. Your main man, Sean Marion, is back as well. And they also picked up Samuel Dallin Bear. They have Shane Larkin, but I don't really know how much you can expect from him this upcoming season. So when it comes down to the Dallas Mavericks, they have a gift and a curse, and it would happen to be the same thing. That is their age. They're a veteran team. If they're healthy, they should go out and perform. But at the same time, can they hold up? Dirk Nowitzki, we all know what he's capable of doing even at the age of 35. He's still one of the premier shooters in the NBA, but will he hold up? Jose Calderon, you can probably pencil him in for 13 or 14 points a game and probably seven or eight dimes. Your main man, Monte Ellis, he's going to be happy that he's not playing with Brandon Jennings anymore because he's going to get that ball. And we all know he's absolutely going to shoot it. How is Sean Marion going to hold up? Can you count on Vince Carter to give you another 13 points a game? The Dallas Mavericks, they're going to be good, but I can't imagine them being great. I can't see them winning an NBA title. I think they have a little bit more work. in their front line, is Samuel Dallin Bear going to hold up? They just need him to be huge, stand around, and block a shot and grab a rebound or two. But looking at him, looks like he can probably pull a hamstring just by stepping out onto that floor. The Mavericks, they're going to be good. I peg them to be a little bit above average. They are not contenders. What do you think about the Dallas Mavericks and their upcoming season? It's JR. You're checking out the Sport Brief. Go ahead and click that yellow button and subscribe. And make sure you hit me up on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. I'll catch you folks later. Peace.